Oops, you're here already. Meet my newborn friend, baby Amoeba. <gasps> Whoa! Hey, come back you. I can't even see you with naked eyes. Ah, forget it. Naughty one, isn't it? But hey, guess why I am here today? To tell you about different types of asexual reproduction. Seems like a tricky topic, right? Don't worry, I'll make it simple for you. Come, zoom in. Reproduction is a biological process through which plants, animals and different kinds of organisms give birth to newborns. There are two types of reproduction, sexual and asexual. But today, we talk about asexual reproduction, where the little one is born from a single parent and genetically similar. Binary fission. Oh, there you are, naughty one. Ha! Huh. Looks like parent amoeba is here too. Well, now we'll see how amoebas reproduce. Their process of reproduction is known as binary fission. As we all know, amoebas are a single-celled organisms and they reproduce when the nucleus inside the cell divides itself into two equal halves. And later, these two nuclei split into individual cells, resulting into two separate but genetically identical amoebas. Budding Some bacteria like yeast use budding as their form of reproduction. A small growth appears on the body of the parent which grows with time and once fully matured it breaks off from the parent body. Organisms like hydra and even some jellyfish reproduce through budding. Vegetative Propagation Some plants give birth to new ones through vegetative propagation. Here, certain plants reproduce when buds form at their roots. And later, those buds grow into newborn plants. Buds even form on leaves and stems. Potatoes are grown through vegetative propagation. Fragmentation here the organism splits into fragments and each of these fragments develop into fully grown organisms that are clones of their parent organism. California blackworms, when cut into pieces, wriggle away as two separate California blackworms. Trivia time! Komodo dragon can reproduce both sexually and asexually. A tree called Saharan Cypress produces young ones through male pollens only. So kids, this is me. Whoa! Zooming out. Tune in next time for more fun facts.